What's up, guys? What's the haps? What's up, you guys? Jasmine here. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably like the thousandth time that I've made this video because I actually had no idea what to talk about, so I had to go back and rewatch the episode of Tino for like, like a thousand times. I, I had to watch it quite a few times. After watching the episode of Teen Wolf like a thousand times, I decided I'm going to talk about Lydia Martin and Meredith and the awesomeness that is Banshees because why the heck not? First off, I just really want to talk about Meredith because after Meredith died in like season 4, I was pretty convinced that was it for her. Meredith is gone. She's donezo. She's gone. She's dead. She's out of the picture. Bye bye But no. She's in Lydia Martin's mind. Why? Because I think Lydia, honestly, partially probably feels a little guilty about Meredith dying even though she was the benefactor. I don't know. Anyways, um, Meredith, yeah, so she's teaching Lydia how to use her voice because, honestly, since we found out that Lydia was a banshee, she has had no idea what to do. We've heard her say, I'm this, but I don't know how to use it. Like, it's cr like it was just mind-blowing to me because, like, when Scott... Found out he was a werewolf, you know, he went to Derek, and, well, kinda, in season one, he figured out how to werewolf and stuff. Anyways, the point is, Lydia has never had anybody to actually help her at all. So the fact that, basically, she's unconscious, and in her conscious, con conscience, whatever that word is, she's thinking about Meredith, and Meredith is helping her while she's, like, not responsive, basically, is crazy cool. In my opinion, I really like the scene when Lydia turns around in whatever room she was in and she sees that Malia's on the ground and like, at first she's like confused but then like she's motivated to save her. That was pretty kick but awesome. Before I continue talking about Meredith and Lydia, I just want to talk about why Lydia's mom is rude. Okay, one, you kick Styles out. Two, you freak out like a few episodes ago when Styles is in the same freaking hospital room to freaking see her and you're just like this is your fault um excuse me miss martin but where the heck were you when all this drama went down where were you when your daughter was strangled by a duroc where were you when your daughter was dating a kanima where were you basically when everything bad happened to your child exactly my point so don't come at styles because styles honestly was always there for her where were you where were you, Miss Martin? Look at your parenting before you come at some other kid and his friends for ruining your kid's life. Bud. Now that I'm done ranting, because that just came out of nowhere, I want to talk about how, um, how this episode connected all the way back to the very first episode of Season 5. I thought that was pretty dope, because I'm not going to lie, the first episode I was confused how it showed Lydia, like, being pew, 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 pew. You know? And then it went to, like, the past, I guess. I, I was confused by that. But now that I've watched last night's episode, I was just like, okay, I, I, I see. Like, it's just, like, it showed Lydia, like, recalling the events up to where, you know? Like, where last night's episode was. And I don't know. It was pretty dope. Even though it was kind of confusing, though. I don't know. Team Wolf's confusing me. Makes my head hurt a lot. But yeah, that's... That's that, so... I don't know. Lydia's freaking awesome. Teen Wolf this season is pretty dope. I'm excited for next week's episode. Hopefully I don't miss next week's episode. I had to miss last night's episode. Uh, due to work. Yeah, I worked until like 10 o'clock, so I couldn't watch it, obviously. And then, yeah. So, that's that. And I know this video was kind of whack, it's kind of dull, and I'm not gonna lie, it was kind of last minute. I'm sorry. I will try to get better at this, and, um, before I sign off here, uh, I'm gonna try to get back into making videos every single week. I'm gonna try my best to. There's probably gonna be weeks where I forget, and I'm, I'll probably apologize for it, but I'm gonna try to get back into making videos every single week. I'm gonna try my absolute hardest, I promise. Um, tell me down below in the comments your thoughts on Lydia and her being, like, pretty freaking cool and kicking people's butt. Tell me, tell me down freaking below in the comments. Don't forget to like this video and share it with your friends because it would make my heart happy and happy hearts lead to long lives. Fact. Not really. And lastly, do not forget to subscribe to my channel for two new videos 
every other week or every week depending on my mood. I don't know. I'm sorry. Peace out, guys.